Hello, oh, doers. Since the launch of my help desk teams, Stealthywood has received a good number of support tickets. My teams have been working diligently to resolve them all, but I want to check in with my customers even after their ticket has been closed. With customer ratings, I can do just that. Customer ratings allow my customers to give my company feedback. When a customer chooses to leave a rating, they can choose between a happy face, a neutral face, or hopefully not, but a sad face. They can also leave additional comments within a text box. Now, customer ratings are a great way for evaluating our help desk team's efficiency. They can also identify pain points for a company and they establish our credibility because we've got to reply to them. Let's see how it works in Odoo. Now, the very first thing we're gonna to wanna to do is activate customer ratings within our help desk team settings. To do that, I have to click on my help desk app, which we're already inside, and we're gonna to wanna to locate our customer care team, and we're gonna click on these three dots, and we're gonna go into the customer care team's card, and we're gonna go right into settings. Now, once we're inside of settings, I'm gonna scroll down to the performance section, and I'm gonna check the box next to customer ratings. So we're down over here, oh, we went a little bit past it. Here we have it, customer ratings, we're gonna turn that on. And we're also gonna turn on publish this team's ratings onto uh, our website. Now, the first item ends up publishing any sort of ratings that we get on the help page of our website, and we wanna do that. So we're gonna check that box. Now, the second item is a link to set an email template on the stage. But let me save my settings first before we click on that. And now we're gonna go right back. Now, once we click in here, where we're at is our stages page. This is gonna list out all the stages that I have. And on my help desk teams, this is also going to allow us to see which teams they are going to be available to. I wanna click on the solve stage and I'm gonna hit edit. So we're gonna click on solved. I'm gonna go into edit. Then in the email template field, I can select ticket rating request and it's already there. And what this is basically is it's a template that comes preloaded into Odoo. Now, if we click in here, we can actually see what it looks like. Now, as you can tell, it's just kind of a simple message. We can also end up editing it and it's going to just basically ask customers to rate us by clicking on one of the emoticons. I can also edit the text here and I can add any attachments here, but I like the way it looks. So I'm just gonna hit save and I'm gonna leave it as is. And then I'm also gonna hit save again, just to make sure everything was applied and double checked. Now, when I move a help desk ticket to the solve stage, Odoo will automatically know to email them that template to let them know, hey, give us a rating. We wanna know how we did. Did we do good, neutral, or bad? Now, if you also have the live chat enabled, what that ends up allowing you to do was it'll automatically uh, send a rating request over when a customer ends a chat. Now, we're pretty much done here. So what we're gonna wanna go do is show how a customer sees this. Now, customers on your website, scenario will happen because you're a business. A customer can go to your help page and once that they're here on the website, they can chat with a help desk agent. So if we click on live chat and then we type something in, hi, hello, very generic, gives them no identifying <laughs> markers or meaning, but they know. We said hi. Now, once the customer is done chatting, they can click on the X to close the window and end the conversation. But before the chat window closes, the screen changes to a rating request with the same emoticon options we saw earlier in the email template. If the customer chooses the neutral face or the sad face, a text box will appear for them to explain their rating, as you can see here. They can also enter their email to receive a transcript of their live chat conversation in case, you know, they want to review it. What did I say? What did I ask? How did they help me? Those types of things. Now, we're done here for now, but once again, customer ratings are crucial for improving my team's customer service. Thanks to automatic email templates and live chat rating requests, I can make sure each customer has an opportunity to be heard. So stay tuned for a new video on how to generate reports for analyzing your customer ratings. Until then, thank you for watching. Have a great day.